So far, we built Chicky Boom Boom's Tori and assembled the bridge for her doggy Zen guard. Now it's time to play with some textures, and Grace has some ideas for the Zen pathway. What do we got? So I just brought samples of different types of textured carpet squares so cool. that you can kind of figure out which one will lower. be the best for the Zen pathway. Ignore right. the colors, just feel the textures, they're all a little bit different. I like this pile the best out of all of these. The Those are a little too industrial. Okay. The Zen Inspire room I'm designing for Chicky is going to have many different textures to stimulate her senses and to help map her way around the room. Being that she's blind, you know, we have the different textures. You have a nice transition into the carpet. Make it all flow together. Right? Yeah, I love that. Well, the cool thing about this is when someone yeah. makes an accident, peel it up, scrub it right out, dry it out, put it right back in. So I'm going with carpet squares rather than traditional carpet, because if there's an accident, not the whole carpet is ruined. Yeah. Frankie, is this OK? Lay down. Get in the, get in the carpet square. Lay down. <laughs> this is made for you. Made for Chicky Boo Boo. <laughs> <laughs> Being that Chicky is blind, we don't want her to trip over any sharp edges. So we're going to cut out a notch where the carpet meets the plywood to ensure a seamless fit between the textures. So now, this is the same depth. Right. Wow, look at that. Look how clean that looks. Yeah. Perfect. Dogs love den-like spaces. That's why they love their kennels, but most of them are ugly. I was inspired by the gate at the Japanese garden, so I want to create something similar. Look at these, right off the bat. Quick one, Chewy. That way it ties into the Asian theme of Chicky Boom Boom's playroom. I got an artist friend that's going to help me out. Did you get those files? Yeah, I do. Just got them on the computer over here. So for the front of the kennel, I'm going to use this cool machine that's going to give us a laser accurate cut to the 3 quarter inch composite material. The red lines are our cutouts. Correct, exactly. Right. This is like printing stuff at home, like on your uh, regular. Exactly, yeah. yeah. I mean, it essentially is a giant printer, but instead of ink, it shoots out a laser beam. CNC is computerized laser, where you can cut out all these crazy shapes and sizes with a computer. Do steel on this, wood, anything, right? Yeah, Pretty much. steel, wood, foam. I say we fire her up. All right, sounds good. I'm gonna have to go get some coffee. This high powered laser is amazingly accurate, and the cuts it makes would take me at least a couple days. And one mistake would mean I'd have to start all over again. Chicky's gonna love this. Oh, yeah. Chicky boom boom, baby. <laughs> Then we can kind of slide this one off the table a little bit and start taking some of the middle pieces out. Usually, I use a router bit, so it's a little more of a, a cut space. He's using a laser, so it's super tiny cut. So we got to go through and pop out all these pieces. This is good for that, what, uh, ADHD? Yeah, exactly. You get a little bit of, like, bubble wrap popping yeah. or something. Yeah. Get these last couple, and we all set. Want to stand it up? Check it out. Oh, yeah. That's sweet, man. Yeah, it's definitely like a cool uh, dog kennel, no? Oh, yeah. It's going to be great. All right. You want to help me load it up? Yeah, sure. Cool, cool. Let's do it. We're going to prime and paint it at the shop. All right. You guys ready for upstairs? Definitely. All right. Let's go check it out. Chicky, ready? <laughs> oh, my God. Oh, wow. <laughs> wow. That's incredible. What? Oh, that's perfect. That's amazing. Wow. Oh my god, it is beautiful. It's perfect. 
have your own little, speech uh, You have your own little zen garden, monkey. Oh, I didn't even see this. I walked right by. You got fresh parsley. Oh, we got perfect. cilantro, basil. This is absolutely amazing. That is awesome. Amazing. Now we have a room that's for everybody. It's safe for Chicky Boom Boom. It's cool for you guys to hang out. We got a little sound of water. You have the textures of the carpet. As she goes through, she'll be able to map this place out. She'll feel her way around, and yeah. she'll she'll know exactly yeah. where she's at. Cool thing with these these carpet tiles is these pop out. These carpet tiles come out, and you can just wash it off, put pop it right back in. That it's is incredible. super handy. I think that the textural difference is such a huge part of Chicky's learning curve for getting to know the house. Being able to walk around and feel the tactile sensations between one place and another makes that so much easier for her to memorize and know where she is at all times. And so we made this little Japanese-inspired bridge with the Tori, and it has the little sensory vibes for when Chicky Boom Boom comes through, she'll know where she's at, and it kind of leads to her new pee pad corner. So now you've got some fresh grass that can be delivered to you year-round. Perfect. That's great. We did the dog kennel, kind of flank sides where the friends come over and chill, but also for anybody who's on lockdown, <laughs> just locking down in there. Time out room. Time out room. <laughs> Perfect. And then treats, dispenser, because everybody needs treats. Now it's a room that's safe for everybody. Now yeah. when all the friends come over and play, they have their zone, you guys can chill. You have your little lounge area. It's perfect. It is perfect. <laughs> There's six feet of snow outside. It's going to be beautiful in here. But for when it's nice out, we got the front balcony all dialed in. So let's check that out. Awesome. Oh, wow. This is so beautiful. Now we got another guardrail system right up here. Oh, so awesome. she builds up a little speed. She's got something to stop her. That's great. That's great. Chicky Boo Boo. Oh, good girl. Good girl. Good girl. So she's mapping out the whole setup. Oh, yeah. We threw out a lot of ideas, but Antonio really nailed the ones that were really important to us. Being able to have a safe play space for her year round, being able to have a bathroom for her year round, all the safety precaution stuff was amazing. And to have it all fit in our style and everything else was perfect. Oh, I love the kisses. She's full of kisses. So many kisses. <laughs> oh, you're welcome. You're welcome. What? Oh, you love it? Now that Chicky has this awesome playroom, I want to give her a little surprise. So I wanted to bring some of her doggy friends to have a pup party. And it's not a party without Chewy. Hey. <laughs> Hi, buddy. Oh. Hi. <laughs>